Finally! Henry the Blasian. Brand new. Yo, what's going on guys? Henry the Blasian here and welcome back to another video, man. Now, as you guys can see in front of you today, that's right, man. We're going to be adding yet another pink diamond to our arsenal, man. 95 overall pink diamond Elgin Baylor is finally on the squad. For those of you that don't know, in order to get this card, you've got to Evo every single domination card in the game. Now, in case you need some context, that means every single emerald card in domination. And then you got to do all the ruby cards right right here and then the regular rubies that become amethyst and then the nate archibald and artist gilmore that become diamonds to pink diamonds you get that all done you can get yourself this elgin baylor now the best part about this elgin baylor is just like the jason richardson last year he can evo up to a galaxy opal and i'm looking forward to getting that done and then we'll get yet another gameplay that'll be my first galaxy opal of the year but uh this elgin baylor to be honest is looking a lot more promising than the jason richardson did last year so i'm excited to see what this card's all about and we're going to be talking about whether this card is really worth the grind so if you guys are new to the channel make sure you hit that sub button we are on the road to 250k and let's also aim for 1500 likes on today's video man because guys this was a grind but you know that i do it for you guys man but uh yeah let's dive into the stats and off the bat you can see 94 offensive overall and 89 defense standing at six foot five playing the small forward position only small forward which honestly isn't that bad i think i'll be able to to make it work you know i had to deck him out with a contract and a shoe already he's got a 93 driving layup 85 post fade the shoe puts his three pointer from an 87 to a 90 solid 88 mid-range now an 88 driving dunk 84 ball handling is not the worst decent defense 84 perimeter steel definitely needs to be higher solid interior defense as well great rebounding and he is so fast man 95 speed and 94 acceleration with an 85 speed with ball 84 lateral quickness the stamina and hustle and mental game it's all looking good now as far as badges guys he comes with two hall of fame badges 17 gold seven silver and two bronze you cannot add badges to an evo card so this is what he comes with catch and shoot he's got gold dimer pick dodger contact finisher downhill quick first step so those are nice to in gold all of these upgrade to gold later on when he does evo so that'll be a nice look but uh elgin baylor before i do choose to evo you and put in yet another grind i gotta see just how good you really are man so without further ado let's hop into a game and let's see what this king diamond elgin is all about let's get into it all right in our matchup today's looking like free agent damian lillard luka Doncic, kobe zion and diamond demarcus this guy might be a little new to the game let's give him a warm welcome all right ladies and gentlemen welcome to another htb gameplay today we are debuting elgin baylor i don't expect him to be a crazy dribbler because he only has 84 ball control but uh, let's blow by kobe right here to the rim and put it down on demarcus to start the game this man is a certified posturizer already we're off to a much slower start in this game than i would have anticipated but that's okay in the corner pump fake i'm blown right by again to the rim so his rim running is definitely there let's see what the shooting's like i know 2k tweet uh tweak the shooting a little bit i don't know what is the best method now the shot stick or square let me know in the comment section what you guys use he's trying to go off with kobe that's not going too well for him uh once again back to elgin i want to get open for a shot kobe's open easy mid-range right there we're lagging a little bit but we knock it down Let's keep it going man teams on both ends right now are just really not knocking down their shots elgin baylor getting open oh i think he read that let me get in the post though elgin baylor's a post dog that get in there there we go i'm a big man for a reason look at that drop step by baylor baby let's go now from what i've been told so far guys apparently shooting with a shot meter off while using the square button is the wave so i'm gonna see if he can fall for the screen if he does you know we're going right into it hit that screen thank you pull in oh i'm a little bit late there but the shot goes down it's a nice quick jumper i'll take it we're still lagging man 
This guy's got a free agent Paul George as well, and it's guarding Elgin Baylor, but that's okay. One jab. Oh, that's too much space to the rim. Hey! Bro, look at those dunk animations, though. Good defense right there by Jerry West. Look at who's in transition. Elgin Baylor, beautiful dunk there in transition. His dunk animations last year bothered me. I'm liking them this year. Bait the pass, bait the pass, bait the pass. Good defense there, Mike. And there was nowhere else he was able to pass it. Kobe, I see you in the corner. 4-3, green bean. Let's go, baby. Now we're on a run. Good Thank defense, bro. The bump steals right now are actually going wild. Baylor in transition, not putting it down. We get the layup once again. That was like an insane, what, 12-0 run right there? This guy's boxed. This guy's boxed. How many bump steals are we going to get this game? How many? I'm sorry. Paul George, hold that. Free agent cards don't get mercy here, baby. Who's open? Let's get the second quarter started off hot, just like the end of that first, man. Hit that screen all the way to the rim. Oh, I draw the foul. Okay, I thought we wouldn't draw the foul, but his draw, man, driving to the rim with this card so far is ridiculous. I will say that. Oh no, I forgot to turn my shot meter on for just free throws. I forgot that was a thing this year. All right, second free throw right here. You guys can see very easy, 88%. Bruh, this Elgin Baylor right now is a beast and our opponent has left the match. That's gonna do it for the first game right there. You know that's not enough, man. Let's hop into another one. All right, on to game number two. This time it's Derrick Rose, Allen Houston, Richard Jefferson, Giannis, and DeMarcus Cousins. A much better team. Let's see what Baylor can do, man. All right, man. Game number two in the Lakers short shorts. Let's show them what we're about. Oh, Mike is rolling through, though. I got to put that down right there. Look at our Laker lineup. Everybody on this lineup is a Laker except for Giannis. Is this a foreshadowing? Maybe. All right, let's keep it going here, man. Elgin Baylor, let's see what you're all about. Oh, let's get a backdoor cut. He's playing super tight there with Richard Jefferson. And one for Baylor. Let's keep the storm rolling, man. We're cooking. Now, initially, I had the same worry as everyone else. Baylor is six foot five. That might be a problem. It has not been a problem so far. Let's keep pushing the pace here. Baylor, I need you to run. You got that 95 speed. Show it to me. Backdoor cut. Come here, Giannis. It's too easy. Contact layup for days, man. The shot contest this year, it just makes no sense. That's a good contest by Giannis. Give me that. That's a steal. Let's go. Baylor bait. That's what we're going to call it. Baylor bait. And he goes for a layup. Okay, so that's something you should definitely dunk. But great defense. Easy mid-range right there, not a green, but it is a bucket. My shot meter is back on. I got to make sure to turn it off a bit later, but right now it's a tie game. We're doing our thing. It's just this random leg that's driving me crazy, and he's just rim running with Derrick Rose. Luckily, we stop it right there. Baylor's too faster for Richard Jefferson. Coast to coast, we draw the foul, and we got more free throws. The biggest advantage to this Baylor card I've noticed so far is definitely his speed, especially in transition. There's just no cards in the game right now that can really keep up with him. So for that reason, I think he's worth to grind on early on. Later on, maybe not. While we got takeover, I'm going to try to get an open shot. This is a Carmelo Anthony card on me. Are you serious? Let me go get open for three. Get around that screen. Catch and shoot. Diver me, mama. Let's go. Give me that. That's good defense. Let's get the second quarter started. Gary Payton, the glove. alley oop it. Kobe Bean in transition. That leg low-key ruined the dunk, but boy, was it beautiful. Good defense by Giannis. This guy is very baited right now. Kobe Bryant, you guys already saw the gameplay on this card. You know what he's about, bro. This Laker lineup is deadly. Bait the pass. Good defense right there by Gary Payton. Like I said, the bait don't stop. George Mikan, hop into it. Into Baylor. That's an easy layup in transition. Come on now. You can't stop us. One thing I do have to say, though, is I am impressed by how well I'm playing for my first unlimited games in a minute, man. Like, I've really just been grinding offline for these Evos. I'm surprised this guy hasn't closed that. He's turned the ball over like 15 times in the last 10 minutes. Nice rebound there by Mikan. Let's keep it rolling. I'm seeing the glove. The glove to Baylor. Dimer me, mama. Not a green, but it's a bucket. Let's go. We're trying to bait passes out here. Trying to bait passes out here. Come on. What did I say? You can't pass anything safely. Mitch Richmond right there in transition. Another turnover for this guy. His whole starting lineup is completely cold. Usually it's more like a takeover vibe. I just completely walk through Lillard right there. And that's an easy dunk. So this guy's plan all game is to rim run with either Derrick Rose or Damian Lillard. Which honestly is fine with me. Because guess what? Threes are better than twos. Green B. Pump fake. Pump fake. Uh, let's go to Mike and see. This is a nice little mismatch. Get in there. 
Get in there. If he helps with Demarcus, it's wraps. That's all. I'm gonna say that. Nice easy drop step and easy layup. Come on. We're in the third quarter right here, and look at how he zigzags to get to the basket. It's actually kind of sickening. Give me that. That's a good steal. I know you always want to give it to Derrick Rose, and that's not happening anymore. Let's go right to Baylor. Blow by. Hop into it. Hey, give me that, baby. One more bucket here to close out the third quarter. Let's get that done. Catch it. Oh, I was hoping he'd contest it, but all the way through. Oh, I thought he'd put it down, and we get the contested layup. Elgin, you're built different, bro. I'm making sure Derrick Rose doesn't drive. He can what? do anything else, but Derrick Rose just continues to go to the basket as much as he wants, man. I almost got baited there. Let's go right to Baylor. Snatch back. Oh, that didn't work out like I planned. Uh, hit that screen. Thank you. Stop and pull up for the mini green bean. Lock up, lock up, lock up. You're not rim running anymore. What? Enough of th oh, ho, ho. What is this game? Have you ever seen a Kobe to Elgin alley-oop? Well, let me show you what it looks like. That was kind of soft, but I'll take it. Yeah. Give me that. That's a steal. Thank you. Let's go, Baylor. All right, let's close this game out. Kersey, just run with it. Alley-oop that to Mike. It's A. Just over a minute to go, man. I want to let it fly a couple more times with Baylor. So get open, catch and shoot, green. Yo, that jumper is so easy, and it's actually fast. Like, that's what I like a lot about it. Give me that. That's so baited. Where did you think you were passing that ball? We're lagging a little bit. Doesn't matter. Look at the fouls, man. Come at me. Oh, Baylor's getting open. Catch and shoot again. Green bean. Okay. Nice rebound there by Kersey. Come on. Let me get a couple more buckets to end this game off. Baylor, he's going to the basket and putting it down. All right. So as you guys can see, man, one of my higher scoring unlimited games, we win 81 to 62 with Baylor going absolutely crazy this whole game. Let's go ahead. Let's check out the box score and let's see how our boy did. And as you guys can see, man, what a show by Baylor. 50 points, four rebounds, one assist, Four steals, but it felt like everyone was defending because Mikey had four steals. Jerry West had two steals. 20 for 29 from the field. Five for eight from three. Perfect from the free throw line. There is nothing to complain about when it comes to this Elgin Baylor. In fact, I'm even more excited now to Evo this card than ever. If he's playing this nice already as a pink diamond, I can't wait to see what those additional badges and stats are going to do for this card. But the real question is, is this card going to be worth the grind? Now, to be honest, if you're a no money spent player, I always think it is because this actually looks like a card that'll last a decent time. If you're a person that spends money on the game and you're a casual player, then it's most likely not going to be worth it because in about like a month's time when you'd probably complete all these evos because unlike me, you guys don't have just as much time as you want to play the video games. So the card will probably be outdated in I'm going to say a month and a half. So you guys might as well not waste your time. But at the same time you guys got to keep in mind the 2k seems to be rewarding people that collect all these offline cards so i feel like there's gonna be a big collection reward for collection for collecting these domination cards and it just might be worth it but uh whether you get it or not it's really not going to affect your every day on unlimited if you prefer to do other things then go ahead and do so you're not going to be pissed if you miss out on this baylor but you're also not going to be pissed if you grind it for the baylor like either way you go with it you're going to be fairly happy with the results but uh yeah with that being said guys i gotta get to evoing this card to now a galaxy opal and then we're gonna see what that's all about but uh, with that being said this is gonna be the end of the video if you guys did enjoy the video don't forget to leave a like and for you new viewers you know you gotta hit that subscribe button and join the blazing nation i want to thank you guys for watching i hope you all have an awesome day and take care